Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, we got a new show for y'all. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Welcome to Talk Up. We tried to count it down in uh, in style, but uh, Major P just wasn't paying attention again. How many times? How y'all doing out there? Uh, we back, y'all. Last week we had some technical difficulties. We trying to get it uh, together around here because that's how we do it, y'all, right? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? yeah. Sure. That's right. That's right. <laughs> How you doing, Daryl? I'm good. And who water is this? Oh, my bad. I thought I got an extra water. If I said that, <laughs> we got a lot for y'all tonight. We got food. We got some promotion. What a t-shirt. It fell all down. We got we got some black on uh, has, uh what you call the places that sell weeds and stuff? Is that weeds? No. Yeah, weave. Oh, weed. They said weed. Yeah, weed. How about I say it? The, the beauty supply? Beauty supply. Beauty supply. Beauty. Beauty supply. They said weed there too, though. Really? They do. Yeah, I guess In Houston? Special code. Yes. Back rooms. Oh, oh. <laughs> Are we Facebook Live? Huh? Is we live? <laughs> I'm just trying to find it. Oh, we are? So. Um, well, well anyway, we got some food. We got some food. We got some. Uh, Is it tight? From. What is this called? What the, what is green called? seed vegan? Green seed vegan. Green. We got some fried cauliflower right here. Here y'all. Right in the heart of That's Third Ward. Right in the middle of Third Ward. We're gonna do some other vegan spots too, but tonight we're doing green seed. Come on. Man, I thought this is like some fried shrimp, or some or some fried buffalo. That's actually uh, fried cauliflower. Yeah, it's fried, it's fried cauliflower luggage. They are delicious. Too big. We ain't supposed to be doing this at all, but no. you want some? No. You sure? <laughs> you, hey, pass that we sauce already over discussed there. this before we even no, got on air. I was going to eat that. I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, right. But yeah, uh, hey, man. Green Seed Vegan Restaurant right on the corner of uh, Almeda and Willard. Almeda and Willard. Mm -hmm. Y'all know what that said. Okay, Delicious. Okay, so we got some of the snack on. Snack. This might be gone by two minutes. And um, in-store snack, you know. Snack, short bites, short eats. Want y'all to support all the black businesses? There's a black vegan long. place, and we got black beauty supply places. We got a whole bunch of them. Eight three two six Broadway. Oh, well, I ain't gonna say all of this, but I will put it up on the screen later on. But uh, we got a lot of hot topics tonight. Uh, my name is Silky Black. We got D Rail in the building. DJ D Rail in the building, baby. We got Nigel P in the building. Nigel. Mm -hmm. And last but not least, Seashell. Oh. What's up? Banging them out in here. Gang, 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 gang. Gang, gang, gang. Seashell looks like an ex gang member. I can see it in my face. For what? Didn't I tell you about that story? Ah, don't wait, say wait, that. Wait, wait, okay, wait. I'm not. Okay, I'm not. I'll leave that for you. I knew it. Wait, wait, wait. Like, wait, what? There's a story? <laughs> yes, there's a rip, but we, we're we not going to tell. That's another day. Okay, that's, that's fine. Another I day. just wanted to make sure that that was correct. That's and y'all just let me know it's correct. Girl. Hey. <laughs> a little banging. It, it got real. When got real. Told, when she told me the story, I was sweating. Three, got three bodies under <laughs> here. Three bodies under <laughs> here. Right? Hey, man. Dry snitching. Okay. Chill. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, oh. I I'm telling you, it gets really real. All right. But, so how was y'all weekend? Good. Did anything exciting? Study. That's not exciting. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, don't know. I, I mean, but that's what I did, you know. <clears throat> I studied. Right. That's... I was learning, so that was fun for me, you know. That's, learning. that's always good. Good yes. learning is always good. I mean, yes. it's cool with everything. 
Yeah, you know, it's not all that exciting. To learn, you know. You're right. So what did you do this weekend? <laughs> I, DJ'd a, I DJ'd a couple of events in Louisiana. Oh, look at you. Oh, see, he's all on there. How'd that go? All the Mardi festivities? It was good. It was my cousin, them. Shout out to Vinton, V-I-N-T-O-N, Louisiana. And uh, my cousin, Luana. Cotton just turned 40, 41. She trying to say 21. I think she was 41. She my age. She 40, maybe. I don't know. But anyway, happy birthday, girl. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Um and uh yeah, it turned out pretty good, man. We had fun. All my cousins, all my kinfolk. You know, we like to party anyway. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We just party animals. Was the drink there? Oh, they was drunk. Okay. Oh, they was drunk. You know how they do in Louisiana? Yeah, all day. Wake up. What you did? I went to Lake Charles. Oh, you was in Louisiana too? I was. Followed your boy down there. Hey. <laughs> See? See? We were supposed to have, um, I guess they were going to have a Mardi Gras parade, but it was canceled because of the rain, so we just went to the casino. In Lake Charles? Yep. Hmm. They have it. Too bad. The it was pouring down. So how's the cauliflower? Oh, I hear you smacking over there. It's delicious. I was really about to say the same. I'm like, I can Man. hear all. So I'm about to be on a mic. I can so. hear it. The mic sounds <laughs> nice. Check one. The mic sounds nice. Check two. Let me tell y'all. I am a superman. I caught the kill flu. I took some vitamin C, B12, and kicked his ass. I'm still alive. You know the kill flu been going around and killing people? I didn't know that was the name of it. That's the name of the kill flu. It's called the kill flu? The kill flu been killing people. I, I know that it has I don't think they call it, it, it the kill flu. It does have a name. No, it's the kill flu. I, I, this, I don't think it was called the kill flu. This lady got <laughs> sick. She was, this I lady, don't think that, I don't, don't lady, that is. Not this lady got sick. Right. She said, oh, I'm tough. I'm going to fight it off. Next thing you know, she's <laughs> dead. <laughs> They were packing into that hole. I was, I was in, in my mind. I was not yeah, supposed bro. to laugh at that shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, yeah, this I, is I true. I feel bad. I laughed at a dead person. Yeah, it's true. It's true. I don't think it's true. He made up. Some, no, I was or, serious. Or first, some he, imaginary woman that he made well, up. Well, first of all, the story. You still over there with that old uh, that old man cough. So I don't think yeah, my know. cough is getting a whole lot better. Y'all should have heard it. So we day. don't know if you killed the, yeah, you the kill man flu. Thing. It's still over there. Oh, I'm I'm still blinking, so I killed it. I'm I'm uh -huh. I'm back I'm back at it, baby. Well, it's punching the shit out your throat right now. That's just my that's just my bronchitis acting up. Mm -mm -mm. Fix it, Jesus. Somebody. That's <laughs> anyway. What y'all got? Y'all got some hot topics for us? What's yeah, the hot do. topics? Where do we begin? Um, did you guys hear about the two black ladies that uh, were profiled at Applebee's? I did. Yes. Okay. What are y'all's thoughts? Did you hear about it? No, what actually, go ahead and tell the story. Oh, well, okay, so I'll explain the story. Thoughts. So, um, these two black women went in to, uh, I guess, one had makeup on, mm -hmm. and the other one was really skinny, because these were the descriptions. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, hmm. they went in to go eat at Applebee's, and this waitress, I guess, went and told her manager and mall cops that um, these people had dined and dashed the night before. Mm -hmm. Now these two women said we weren't even in this city. <laughs> <laughs> we <laughs> we weren't even in this town the day before. Um, but they brought the police um, to their table, mm -hmm. and they were asked to leave. Well, pay for their food and, and leave. Uh, no. And one of the young ladies, um, I guess she was in shock by the entire uh, experience. She broke down and yeah, like she broke down. And some serious tears. And I think one of yeah, very emotional. Very. And I think one of the two things happened. She is either one of the people that always say, Well, they shouldn't have been doing this and they shouldn't have been doing that. And she her feelings was hurt. She was crying. She couldn't even hardly talk. She was like, Oh no. <laughs> Y'all can pull it up and watch it. But what? I, I don't know if I believe that she's one of those people who just never thought. Me neither. I don't know. I don't know if that's the case or not. But whatever it was, 
her feelings was hurt bad. I mean, it's, I think with today, with everything that's going on so frequently, and all this different stuff you see on the news and on social media and everything like that, because seeing it it's just so constant and current. Mm -hmm. that, that shit for mm -hmm. crime break you down, because then that shit for crime come in your face and you like, damn, this shit is for real. This shit really happens. Yeah, I think overall she was just in shock that it was happening to her. I'm uh, telling you. <laughs> what? Because this husband been out came home. through and was like, let me help you out. Um, but now the young women, I will, I felt really bad for them, and I wonder how Applebee's in the end is going to respond. Um, is to cut that chick? Yeah, she's going to get. They're going to get paid because, <laughs> because if the cop, they're, if they're the cop able, was like all nonchalant. He kept saying, "Oh, he was mocking them." Yeah, he was like, uh, mm -hmm. "I'm not yelling at you. Why are you crying? Why are you, you calm yelling? her down? She is. She's over. Are y'all done with her? Are y'all done with yes. her? Y'all can leave. Oh, what are you God. done? Because I'm trying to eat." These, uh, these shrimp. Mm -hmm. oh, he was yeah. like, well, what they want you to do is pay and leave and never come back. But it's like, you can't prove Did you see on camera that it was me. And yeah. then you see the waitress come off in a corner. She was like, yeah, that's them. That's them. I was like, come here. No, no, you come and, here. And the descriptions <laughs> that she gave was that one wore makeup and one was real skinny. And it's like, wait, what? Yeah, that's it. Because... Because nobody else looks like that at all. <laughs> no, no, no. The black women. That, you know, we all look like, you know. skinny and you know, not wear makeup. So yeah. 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 But what's the description? The thing is, you know, the, how the girl feelings was hurt. She didn't know why she was getting put out. She didn't understand. That's what it's like for a black men all the time. We when we get pulled over, if we get pulled over, we we don't know if it's our last term or not. You especially nowadays be sweating and, and trying to talk. Without stumbling, because if you do, they can say, "I'm not oh. sweating, y'all." They, they deserve this. I'm yeah, that's me. I'm be sweating. <laughs> I'm, I'm like three shades darker than you. I'll be sweating. I'll be like, "Oh Lord, please, please." Oh. They had this cop. I was going to work one morning, four o'clock in the morning. He stopped me. He walked up to the car with his hand on his gun, and I'm like, "Uh." Okay, what do I do now? So I'm, I'm, I got my sudden movement. Just yeah, I got my full uniform on. So he looking at me like, "Oh, you going to work?" <laughs> no, no, like, <laughs> I'm gonna go pretend like I work at this place. It's yeah. Halloween. It this is my superhero costume. <laughs> yeah. See, you drag your ass out that car, nah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just uh, just uh, just talking too. back. No, I didn't say that. I didn't say oh, that. Oh, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't say that. Oh, I thought you said that. I was like, "You trying yeah, to get drugged out the window?" I'm still alive. I ain't say none of that. Sir, step out. You had a comment. Well, you said now she sees how black men feel as though black women uh, don't get pulled over and have those same exact feelings when they're pulled over by cops. That, that's all I was going to say. Oh, no. I wasn't really saying like, well, now you see how. I'm just saying. That's just how we feel. That's just how it is. Okay. Well, I felt bad for them. Yeah, um, me too. And I can't wait till they actually uh, release the camera footage of whoever the two young ladies were uh, mm. from the day before. The actual. Mm -hmm. Probably look totally different. Yeah. Totally, totally yeah. Is, oh my God. My I, thing is, I don't think you can just walk up to somebody like, I need y'all to leave. They weren't even doing nothing. Like, mm -hmm. Can they do that? Mm -hmm. Or at least. There was no proof. There was no evidence. Just her, her uh, lying eyes telling, her, telling well, them that. that was like them. They was white people in. Yeah, that's, like, oh, that's what they do. <laughs> that's how they do. White people. <laughs> Wasn't you just in here? Uh, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> I want to speak to your manager. Yeah. Look totally. at your manager. I mean, it's just as bad as uh, the situation with the young guy at uh, Old Navy. Oh, that was that terrible. Was horrible. Terrible. You know about that incident too? Nope. Tell me that story. Oh lord. You ain't know about. Man, I ain't <laughs> Okay. okay. I be missing. I miss a lot of stuff with the world. Okay. All right. I be so working. What, what happened with <laughs> the young man at out. Old Navy? Mm -hmm. Was he was shopping in Old Navy, and when he finally went up to the register to purchase uh, the items, uh, they told him that the jacket that he had on uh, was one of theirs. And even oh, though he, I do know this. Y'all, my bad. That was that bullshit. <laughs> blue jacket. <laughs> Okay, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, um, well, just in case for the viewers out there, if they don't know yeah. the story. Um, 
But yeah, they wanted to scan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and then see if it was yeah, his jacket. To see yeah, they wanted to scan the jacket because it. I guess it will now say purchase. I didn't even know that. See, my thing. They don't. They lied. What are they going to scan? They lied. They made. It's made. That's what I was like. I'm like, what are y'all scanning the jacket itself? Yeah. Yeah. It don't even have no scan bar no more. Yeah, I'm like. And he's like, oh, no, no, I don't want it. Shouldn't. Mm-hmm. It shouldn't have it after you. Because think about it, you would have tags. That's yeah, so I'm like, tags. I'm like, y'all can't just scan the jacket and just go magically. And it's like, all you have to do is look on the camera and see I came in with this. Clearly, walk straight in. Like, see, I think I just went put, put the jacket on <laughs> and walked up to the rest. <laughs> see, <laughs> see, they got. I was like, yeah, let me buy all the rest of this stuff. It's yeah. Except <laughs> for the jacket. jacket. Yeah. See, they got a plan. What they plan is they trying to push us. We gonna have to push back or, or leave. Because they got a plan, they pushing us out, they constantly doing this little stuff. Little bitty stuff, little stuff. And then they like, oh well, they gonna get tired. They're gonna get tired of this. But what what need to happen? We need to hit them in the pockets. Oh yeah. We need to hit them in the, deep in their pocket. And we can't start with the uh with the old navy. We can't start with Walmart. H and M. H and M. We can start with H and M. They did hit them in the pockets. Yeah, they did. Okay, well, they have to start shutting down stores. But you know who else we can start with? These hair shops. These uh, beauty supplies. Yeah, these beauty supplies. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Because if they if they start losing money, they're gonna be like, hold, hold up, hold up. Now I do have a <laughs> these corner stores. <laughs> uh, I was gonna yeah. say I do have a comp just like that. Those corner stores and these beauty supplies. I'm like, first off, the service. It's horrible. It's terrible. I mean, I just go in and grab me some stocking caps. I'm not bad. <laughs> 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 so, you okay? But, but, they, but the customer service is non existent at these places. Non existent. Yeah, if we chose to say we we refuse to shop here, they would all go out of business. Exactly, because mm-hmm. basically they're in the community to leech. Oh, you're saying those are black owned BD supplies? Yes. Yes. So. They're just here. They're just leeching, and they're perfect. They don't. They don't bring anything positive into the neighborhood. Mm-hmm. They don't. They don't uh, put back into the neighborhood. Yeah, I'm talking about the new bees. I got this one bees. All solid them. gold that I've been going to since like '95. Even the old it's ones. It, does, it does not matter if it's not black gold. They're, they're leeching. They leeching. You know, I don't know, but it's been that same black lady and the same age lady. No, but, not, but the the biggest issue is that they're that they're. The biggest issue is that their customer base it's is us. It's and to me, what am I trying to say? To me, uh, it's it's kind of like they know that we feel op- well, and we feel like that's the cheapest we're going to be able to get it. So we have to get it from them. I mean, I ain't going they to Sally's. like they have a monopoly. A yeah, they have, they have power. Mm-hmm. See, I'm going to go to Sally's now. No. no, no, you no. go to the black beauty supply. Yeah, they got yeah. a lot of them. They actually got hold of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's three nine. and one, two, three, four. Three times four is twelve. <laughs> Sorry. Dang. Go ahead. Okay. I'm, just, <laughs> I'm, I'm not going to lie. Maybe I'm, I'm, I'm counting right for the kids. You know, the kids, <laughs> well, man, the kids might mean, not be on time tables yet. She, five <laughs> times seven is twelve. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for you to put it higher up because I would have counted the. Yeah, that's, I mean, how, I think that's, that's how you do that. Yeah. That's, how you, that's, that's how you do that, baby. That's, right, that's right. what. Right. Yeah. It's okay. I just want to support my people. That's all. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> support these I don't try. Players. I don't want to try to put them down. Man, nah, I'm nah. You can't count. I'm talking about you. <laughs> <laughs> you too old not to be able to count. Not to be able to count. I want to show you. I want to let y'all know. Is one, two, three. <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good job! Yay! Yeah, that's right. Give me my clap. Yep. Stab it up. <laughs> but no, they got they around town. They around Houston. Y'all be everywhere else. You go all the way to Sugarland for a concert. You can go to around the corner to, <laughs> to go to go to uh. <laughs> One of these black beauty mm-hmm. supplies. Yeah, shit. You know, y'all be using that shea moisture. Whatever yeah. you ever using, your little pink oil, your olive oil. Shea moisture. Oh, and uh, shout out to Coco. Coco Nails. We saw her at, uh, where were we at? Sunshine. Sunshine, yeah. yeah. Another vegan, black vegan place. It's delicious. Yeah, she's a black nail tech. Yes, she is. Hmm. And she thought we were somebody else, but we forgave her and we, <laughs> we kept it pushing. <laughs> <laughs> oh. She cool though, and she does a good job. I used to go to her um, a she, few years ago before I, I had left Houston and came back. She do feet. 
Does she do? She might now, but I know she just I did hands feet. before. I figured you do both. I actually used to go when when I was in Phoenix. I used to go to a black nail technician that did hands and feet. <laughs> mm-hmm. She did feet, y'all. She did feet. I did my feet done. Like and a, she was good too. The black folks don't like tipping the She was out of Detroit. I do your I do your hands. <laughs> I ain't do your feet. <laughs> you do feet. <laughs> <laughs> we need people to do feet. Yeah, that's true. So I guess so we can stop going to these Asian. Matter of fact, I would do feet. I would do women's feet. I would do feet. You know what? That would be a good hey, business for black hey. men hey, to be nail techs and just do pedicures. Let's open it up. You want nah. to do hey, no, seriously. I went to college when I was in school. I got I hair you, license. I want you to say that again. Say it again. I, I went thought, to college when I was in school. Okay, I just make sure you say it right. All right, yeah. go ahead. Nice <laughs> would you go to a uh, to get a pedicure by men? So you, yeah. So no, you walk, too. I would love it. I would. So if you walk in there, you saw me and Dedrick. massage would be bomb. So you oh, walk in there, you see me and Dedrick at the front. Okay, okay, I want them. That you gonna feel confident you're, you're that silky, we gonna be able to You and Silky Black. <laughs> it'd, probably, it'd probably be you and Silky Black. I don't know who Dedrick is. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm, said, I'm sorry. He said, me, me, me and Silky Black. So you walk in there, you see my... Hello. <laughs> That's actually a good, a good, good to be honest, small. that is a good concept. Man, I would be up That's in there. That's a real good concept. I would have to work on my push-ups. Hey, edit this out. I'll be up in there. You can oh, be live. It we live, baby. baby. They already heard it. It's, yeah. it's okay. Oh, oh what happened? Oh, damn. It's okay. All right. Well, I mean, just start working on it. What you be about to? I mean, we just don't need one. Just start working on it. Start working on the plan. Let's do it. All right. I'm Cut the check. I'm there. Cut the check. I mean, all we got to do is take a six-month class. Then I get the bag nail and tumble it. And I, all, all I would do, I would get some real nail techs up in there. I would, I would rub their feet first. What? Doom, doom, doom. Well, your voice change. I thought that was See, and that, like, and that is what? where you're going to go wrong. No, that's so not what. Because be, you're trying to turn it know, into some No, it's not. It's going to be yeah. well. When no, this is because it's got. It's going to be professional. It's going to be well lit. It's going to be a lot of people. It's going to be me two incidences happening. You you want somebody to rub your feet sound like this? Like this, you want me to rub your feet? Uh, You want somebody like this? You want me to rub your feet, baby? You are going to have situations. I'm not going to handle situations because I am a professional. I know how to handle all kinds of different situations. I'm not no I hope so because when their husbands come in there, you talking about you want me to rub? No, I ain't rubbing me too. No. That, you can go over there to the ladies. I'm gonna point them over there. Take your ass to them. Exactly. I'm not rubbing no men's feet. I rub all the ladies' feet. He'll be like, you need to take some of that bass out your voice, sir. <laughs> Why you going okay, okay, like, you, you and your that's trusted you foot wife could get up out of here. That, that's what wow. I'm security. Wow, customer service. That's, that's now, nice. now I have a comment. Go ahead. Because I actually like to go to places where I just get good customer service. And and, and we all that is I'm very just, important. I'm Some people saying, don't care. Black Some people are not. Care. Cause you, uh, Obviously, think, black people don't care. I care regardless no, of where I'm at. I don't know. They, white they, own, uh, no, Chinese black people own, only care black about own, customer black. service when it's some other black people. Exactly. But Asians, <laughs> they treat them like whatever. I start going to all. Mm. All of them will around. stop treating them. And they be right back. Man. And they be right back. But yeah, then they go to a black owned place. Don't ever come back. I ain't so never going back there. They don't know how to treat us. Why you are correct. But I'm giving someone your money through a bullet. Proof glass, and you're mm-hmm. just getting some chicken wings. <laughs> <laughs> how? How is that okay? <laughs> you're just getting they chicken get, wings. Then they that slide you that, glass. That but you okay with that? Yesterday, they so. slide your own bag, make you bag your own bag, make yeah. you bag your own bag. <laughs> yeah. Talk to you crazy. Yeah. Well, Tell you every, then make you stand in there because they don't have no seats. Mm-hmm. You just waiting there. I think that's kind of <laughs> what we're used to. I think we're just so it's not, used a, good, to it's that. not a good condition. It's not. Yeah, it's not. That's horrible. That's that Stockholm syndrome. Oh, no, so I mean, we've been doing that was it? Seven that's what it's years called. Old. That's what it's called, the Stockholm syndrome. And that is what it's called. Love they the like it. The the big words with the big words. Yeah, that's just come. He had to redeem himself after that. <laughs> <laughs> after that, after, 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 after that, five times ten to ninety six. She's trying she try to shoot slug. She's been doing it all week. It's okay. What? Because when I come, it's Monday, sir. Last week, <laughs> all month. Mm. Can I add to this? We on black people. Can I add to that? Can I add to the whole black people thing. 
Deji, remember that thing you sent me maybe about two weeks ago? <laughs> yes. That? He didn't send me anybody's thing. The video. The video that you sent me. Silky. You were very silky. Silky. Sorry, Silky. I'm look, man. Damn, I'm not used to that shit. Black. My bad. Silky. Black. I don't even. Black. Yes, that's, that's better. That's I ain't calling you Silky. That's what it sounds like. A man calling another man silky. silky. Nah, ain't nothing wrong with that. Man, please. <laughs> but nah, I remember that video. Oh, uh, yeah. man box and had the they had the, the Caucasian. You know they erased video. that video. They did. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, I think you were trying to send that to me and it was already down. Which video? Well, well pretty much the um what was like like some little psychiatrist she was at or just some random No, it was in Ireland. Uh Oh about that? them trying to get well, no, black she, men to procreate with their women? No, no, Wait, no, 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 not that. Okay, y'all know. Bitch. <laughs> no, okay, remember the video? Okay, it had like the lady, then it had a little girl sitting at the table. Oh. And they, was they had the picture, and it had different shades of dogs, of the of, black dogs. Of, of black dogs. Oh, they've so been, like, they the been doing that to oh, okay, the dog yeah. And it was like, you know, who's the, who, who's the meanest? And mm -hmm. who, like, who's the mean girl? And she pointed the the very very dark girl, mm -hmm. but who's the nice girl? As the mean the girl? girl, yeah, yeah, wow, yeah, yeah. She, who's the mean girl? She pointed yep. the black girl, and then like, well, who's the nice girl? And then she pointed the the very very white girl, mm -hmm. and then uh, what did she say? Who's the um? Who's the ugly one? Who's the ugly one? Yep, pointed the dark girl. Mm -hmm. But they the, all looked the same. They were just just different just shades. Different shades. Well, mm -hmm. well who, who's the pretty girl? This one. Well, why do you say this one? Because this one looks like me. Yeah, mm -hmm. the ugly one. Yeah. You know what? I did that experiment on my niece. And you know what she did? What she did? She picked the doll that looked exactly like her mom. And mm -hmm. she said, This is this doll is pretty. She looks like my mommy. I was I almost cried. <laughs> I almost cried that day. I did with that that day. I did. <laughs> <laughs> well my thing is why is dark ugly? So it's a little white girl. Why would she think? Media. To a little dark. white girl or to media? A no, it was a white girl. The white yeah. girl that was picking out the color. Yeah, they all. Yeah. They all. Media. Were media. media uh, I mean, I'm gonna bring, to I'm like gonna, I'm gonna bring up a show that I love, that we all love, but um, it's a decent example. How was Pam treated on Martin? Oh wait. <laughs> How was Gina treated on Martin? Oh wait. Let's look at Coming to America. How was the dark skinned sister treated? Woo! Versus woo, the. Woo. And I like her too. <laughs> Versus well, the light skinned sister. Granted, they was in two different countries. No, 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 no. The sister. The sister. The dark skinned gotcha, sister gotcha. Yeah, she was, was treated completely different from the light skinned sister she was coming a to whore. America. Yeah, yeah. She was the whore. She was the whore. <laughs> While the little light skinned sister was the. Church the announcer. Princess, church. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah. The prince picked her. Why me? It's crazy. She didn't even know why. It's just, I, don't, I guess it's just confusing because that little girl was so young. That girl had to be like six. So what, like, damn, media already got you thinking that the dark girl. No, they start young. Is the, the well, before media, I mean, even in the families. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Even in the black families. Mm -hmm. Well, especially in those. Mm -hmm. have, have you guys ever seen a documentary called Ethnic Notion? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it just talks about how... Um, like throughout the um, time and, and media in the U.S. and how they would uh, do these commercials with their little Aunt Jemimas and their little dolls and they would have them like with the big bug eyes and the pink mm. lips, big mm. pink lips yeah, yeah, yeah. and the dark skin and just talking about how that narrative like all throughout the time of like media and different things have like basically conditioned um, the U.S. to believe a certain way about about black people and and uh like their features and mm -hmm. and you know judging them on that with their beauty i guess yeah. and their mm -hmm. european standards but it's on it's on youtube it's called ethnic notion oh, yeah, I know, yeah. that's how i found out tom and jerry was a razor cartoon oh, I, yeah. didn't, I didn't realize that till i was like in my 20s i was like really mm -hmm. yeah it was like, every time some every time somebody get blew up by a bomb, black they got big boots with black face mm -hmm. and, and I didn't know what that was as a kid. I was like, Haha, that's funny. Then they you get older, you're like, wait, man, what? Yeah. 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 Every picture was little black sound mm -hmm. Yeah, they cooking them in a pot yeah, and they yeah, got monkeys no and they mm -hmm. got all kind of stuff. Like, oh, I used to love this show. It's my favorite show. <laughs> I mean, and then that's the same narrative that they did about the continent of Africa. Like, oh, and they, and, mm -hmm. and they would always have on those little cartoons. Those, 
every they always trying to kill somebody and cook them in a pot. Right, mm -hmm. and they the only cannibals. Yeah, on like Earth. oh, they're savage. Look at us, we're civilized. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what's interesting is that the the narrative that they what's up Zach? What's up Dante? What's up Cheryl? <laughs> <laughs> I was just shouting out to you. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I was going to say that the narrative that they gave to Americans of the people in Africa about them being savages and, mm -hmm. um, you know, they're, that they're not civilized, there's a narrative that they give of black Americans over there that they're all gangsters lazy oh yeah. that's right that's right you your people from over there so do they brief them on how we gonna how what what they gonna run into when they come over here no i don't know if that part is true but i did hear of that that there's uh I that when they come here that they're told not to really uh uh hang with african-americans so I that's have, so that's a part of keeping that unity removed from us mm -hmm. yes keeping us separated um because I've had a well, lot they of They can't parties. stop us, baby. You in the house, baby. <laughs> now you <just> see. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Represent. I mean, because it's interesting because no one has, um, the people over there don't know, don't fully know and understand the history of black Americans here. So they have a right. certain viewpoint. But, there's, but then also here, there are people who don't understand the history of what's going on with them over there, whether it's Nigeria, Cameroon, uh, Ghana, or whatever, and so they have a different viewpoint. But we all decide not to be educated on other people. It's like, mm -hmm. well, that's them. This mm -hmm. is us. They don't want to learn about, well, why was it split up like that? Like, mm -hmm. why are their names this? What is that head tax? Remember that? I think that, that happened in, in Africa where they would um, charge a head tax for people for people that were on the continent, like the the people that came in and colonized, which were the Europeans, the French, mm -hmm. the Dutch, the Spanish, mm -hmm. and they would like charge them fees for literally being in their own country, yeah. and it was called head tax. Ah, oh, well, hmm. so I, I wonder how they got. Yeah. So okay. how did they got how they got that much power over that anyway? Where did that start? Because I don't. The know. same way they got power over here. They colonized. They brainwashed people. Did you guys guns. know about Shaka Zulu? Guns. Oh, guns. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, guns. guns. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, but but it's, it's, it's not even just guns. What people are, what my African brothers and sisters, especially my Nigerian ones, <laughs> don't want all here, is religion. Mm. Uh oh. And Shaka Zulu was a good example of how they infiltrated with mm -hmm. religion. Um, That's why they don't and they show did it. it here too. They don't show it no more. They don't show Shaka Zulu. That was anymore. one of the best movies. Uh, they I used to play that when I was watching when I was yeah. growing up. A lot yeah. on TV. I love Shaka Zulu. I don't want to even know. Mm -mm. Yeah, because yeah, it's too revolutionary, and then people would be like, "Wait a minute, what?" Shaka Zulu, and have you guys ever seen a movie called Drum? Mm -mm. He was a he was a a boxer. No. Mm -mm. no. Oh man. Is it on Netflix? That's that that's he right up there with Shaka Zulu. Yeah, he was a he was, was a he was a slave, and um, but they realized that he was um, he was you know he was a boxer, he was strong, and they would have him going all around the different plantations and boxing mm -hmm. and fighting. He was just like their prize. Mm -hmm. You never seen that drum? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you gotta watch Netflix. that. Make a note of. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I saw it. I saw it on a VHS when I was oh, little. Mm -hmm. So that's how I like used to watch it. Probably on Sam YouTube. burned and destroyed that movie. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Whose birthday is someone's birthday? It's my mama's birthday today. Oh. Hey. Happy birthday, mama. It's your mom's birthday? Happy mama. birthday. It's my dad's to birthday. Today? Oh, your daddy was on my mom's birthday. Mm -hmm. Get your daddy off my mama's birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Can't help it, man. My daddy gonna beat your daddy up. <laughs> yeah, my dad's birthday is today. Oh, happy birthday, uh, Mr. Naja P. <laughs> happy birthday. Happy birthday, step, uh, to uh, daddy in law. Ah, uh oh. <coughs> <coughs> right? What? Yeah. What's going on? Drink your water. We live. We <laughs> live, baby. Yeah. Put your head up. We live. What's going on? 
Oh, he choked her up. He choked her up on that one. <coughs> what? That was a joke. Uh, like she's sweating. Yeah, I, oh, look at it. I'm drowning in a spot up in here. <laughs> Whose sister is tomorrow? Sister's birthday is tomorrow. Uh, uh, oh, my sister's birthday tomorrow. Oh, okay. And he had to think about it. No, I did. Ooh, I had to see who said it. Ooh. Yeah, it was, a, it was a few people's birthday. Wait, Bob Marley? Oh, yeah. Don't let him fool you up. Oh, no. A couple of days ago. So what's going on with the Cleveland Cavaliers? Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> I gotta talk about this. Throw the whole team away. What <laughs> is Catch me up. Catch me up. I, mean, I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't know. Basically, they traded. Everybody go. They traded the whole oh, starting line. About that. Except I heard about that. <laughs> except LeBron. LeBron. <laughs> so he gonna bring whoever you want to bring in, right? But his, his boy, Dwayne Wade, gone. The one gone again? Gone. Again. Gone. <laughs> gone. Oh, Lord. Shepard gone. Uh, Iman. Yeah. yeah. Isaiah Thomas. Isaiah Jr. Gone. Ooh, Isaiah, gone. Isaiah went to the Lakers. So, like, hold up. Y'all can't say LeBron did all that. All right. Oh, can you? I, I'm pretty sure he has a very oh, I, big influence. Somebody has that little <laughs> meme of, uh, uh, what was that movie? Juice. What is that movie? The one... I think it is. Is juice. it is it juice? I think so. With Tupac and No, the other Grace one. Grace Clean uh, Cameron. House. Oh, uh Cameron. paid in full. I paid in full. I saw it. Paid that. in full. <laughs> what are you saying? They had LeBron and uh, Dwayne, Dwayne and Isaiah. And it's like the uh, the new uh Cause remember on Paid in Full, full. he basically tried to kill them both. No, you never seen Paid in Full? Oh, I was Come on, that's a good movie. I got to make it for that. Yeah. Right. Anyway. Black. Paid in full and drum. Right, right, right. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Paid in full. And and ethnic notion. notion. Get a clean one. Okay, so Ethnic Notion, YouTube. Drum. Yeah, Drum, the movie huh, about drum. the boxer, the slave that was a boxer. Okay. And Paid in full paid with Cameron. And uh, what's the guy's name? Dang. What's his Mackay name? Mackay Pfeiffer? Was no, no. Name? What are you talking about? Yeah, yeah, Not is it Makai Pfeiffer? Yeah, Who was in Drum? Oh, Zachary Drum. Oh, oh, I mean, I, I'm sorry, and paid in full. Yeah, but that's what I said. Yeah, I, I, see, I remember the, the movie cover. Uh, that's where I knew Makai Pfeiffer was in it. Oh uh, boy, that plays in every goddamn movie. I like him, the tall, skinny guy. <laughs> yeah. And you know who his brother is, right? No. The heavy set guy that looks just like him. He only said no names. Man, yeah, I, I the tall, skinny it. guy. Yeah, yeah. You, know, you know who looks look like him? The heavy set brother. <laughs> no name. Like, remember neither right. one of them. No, right. You know the tall guy, the tall one. The no last like name. Thing. I can't no, no, use no. my phone because I. Okay, it's okay. let let me. I, I can help you. I got you. Uh -oh. Paid in full. What was his name? Yeah, all I know is Cameron. I'm gonna look for a tall skinny dude. Wood Harris. Oh, the guy that's Harris. Harris. I like him. Um, and you know who his brother is? The look Wire. Up his brother. No, who's, who's look up his brother. I only know him for the wire. No, you gonna know who his brother is. You could be like, they Steve, brothers? Steve Harris? Steve Harris. That's, That's his, brother? his brother? That's his brother. Are you serious? Yes. I never knew that. <laughs> Let me see the other guy. That's hilarious. Though. That's his brother? That's his Did brother. Did you watch the wire? No. No. I don't know how to use No, that. you know who Wood Harris is, though. He played in a lot of good movies. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, he, uh, that's, um, uh, that's Jimi Hendrix. No, no. He, did, he did play in Jimmy Henry. He did? Yeah. Oh, no. But see who his brother is. Show him, show him his brother. He showed me. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. See, see, I did not know his brother. And this is brother. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's funny. They are brothers. <laughs> we're brothers. <laughs> we're happy we're and we're singing and, and we're colored. And da, 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 da. Give me a high five. <laughs> you don't look like you're 52. You don't want that? I guess so. I know. The yours. They don't know. Huh? We young and we don't know. No, I didn't know that dude was fifty two. I, I knew the Wayne brothers. Is that what y'all saying? Yeah, that's what they're saying. Yeah, I thought we, I knew that. Okay. And what? And what about uh, what was that? Brothers in Outer Space. Homeboys. Oh, Homeboys, Homeboys, Homeboys in, Space. in Outer Space. The dumbest show ever. Yeah, it needed to go off the air. Lord Christ. Who was in that? Was that? Was that um? Flex. Flex. The, I was gonna say the guy. Flex boy. He wasn't. He wasn't giving up no roles. He wasn't talking about hey my loves. He's wow. saying all. He's saying anything that he. They'd be like, "Well, we paying twenty dollars an hour." I take. Cause didn't he play Michael Jackson in some movie? <laughs> Michael Jackson. Didn't he play Michael Jackson? Yeah. Don't bring that up. That's the most worst. 
He played Michael he Jackson? Played. Yes. You never saw that? Nope. Man. Flex was God. like, I gotta pay these bills. Please bitches. show I got him how they had him dressed up. That I, makeup I, was horrible. I, he played MJ? Man. Man. Y'all don't yeah. remember that? He was doing anything. I, 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 I need to <laughs> do this for Michael Jackson for Tito. Oh, that was old no. boy. That was a boy from a different world. I didn't realize that was him. Ron. Hmm. That played in Homeboys in Our Space too. That was the other cat. I did not see Homeboys in Our Space. That name sound familiar, but I don't. You think never I watched Homeboys in Our Space? They was literally on a spaceship. I ain't never seen Pootie Tang. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I ain't never seen it. Oh man. That's a, the that's name, a funny movie. The name caught me wrong. Pootie Tang. What? What is this? First of all, your name is Silky Black. Oh, that's right. Get out. Come on, come right. on, man. Pootie Tang. That's a right. <laughs> trick. You got to be kidding me! <laughs> that's real. Oh. I don't know. Can you? Can they see this on camera? Let me put it right here. Yeah. Oh man! Put it right here. That's the funny one. Is that one? That's, <laughs> one. that's the one. <laughs> oh man! I don't know. Oh, they heard. Flex yeah. played Michael Jackson. Yes, <laughs> Look at that. Zoom in on that. He can't. Let's zoom, dude. Can you? I don't even it. think he can hear us. Is he on his phone? Who? No, he Akili. Oh, he's is he trying it. to zoom in? He looked like uh DJ uh no uh DC Fly. I don't know who he <laughs> yeah, 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 you do know. <laughs> Hold on, and it gets a little bit Yeah, DC Fly. Yeah. Cuz I just I don't I... We're going to get our camera game up too, y'all, in a little bit. We're going That's crazy. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> <laughs> the <Lucy. laughs> Oh that's my bad. god, look at this. Look at that. Just, that's bad. I don't, that's shenanigans. Talking about just taking on any old role. No, what are you doing? Oh, oh. Just yeah. let him, it's going to take him a minute to zoom in. No, you got to zoom in on this. You zooming in? There you go. Right here. <laughs> Oh Lord. MJ all day. So speaking of so Michael Jackson, did you guys read that Quincy Jones? Ooh. Which, which story That's about him singing? He's oh, he, he he about to die. He's he about to die. die. I'm telling all the secrets. All but I want to hear his secrets. Since oh, he's so exactly. Old. See how, well, how, open, see how open see is he? he was doing. How open is well, he? Well, Tupac had in his grip. How open he was. Ooh. I mean, Tupac basically yeah, he said did. he wanted some. Tupac did. Oh, oh yes, yeah, is yeah. that what the thing about Tupac was? That yeah. he was trying to get with Tupac? Mm-hmm. Tupac basically, you know, went off about him yeah, years he, ago. He said, I mean, because he was no trying to date his daughter. Because he wouldn't know this kind of stuff about Marlon Brando and Richard Pryor and whoever else. Unless he, he was down. Allegedly too. said, unless That's he was down right. too. He was, right. he was in the room. He was, he was all the way around. He was in the room. Mm. Mm-hmm. They, they cubes down for something. And he said Michael Jackson ain't got no bullshit disease. He was having plastic surgery. And he said he was riding him all the time about it. Yeah, like yeah. stop doing that. He was snitching bad. He was talking about how he Michael was. was stealing music. He was stealing yeah. music, so and so's music. Oh, he can't he say that about that. Michael Jackson. They all steal music. They, they do. They they, they do. do every single time. He tried to act like too. he was the only originator, yeah. but no. Mm-hmm. But I want to know what he was doing in them rooms. He sucking, was right there in the sucking dick with the orgy. Right. <laughs> <laughs> he said for what? Sucking dick for money. He wasn't doing it for money. <laughs> he was doing it because he liked that shit. For money, yeah, <laughs> that had nothing to do with money. But man, yeah, man. I, I think that they get some sort of power from um, a second dick. No, I'm talking oh. about no <laughs> the demasculization. <laughs> I'm talking about life for the like, entertainment industry. Oh, no, because I was actually just reading an article and I wanted to send that to you guys, but they were talking about the whole subject of like during slavery and like post and how they would. Like have like the white slave owners yeah. and the white men would have sex with the black men to break them. Dehum- it's called yeah. buck breaking. They yeah, used, buck breaking. They used to do that. They used to take the biggest black man, mm-hmm. tie him up, spread his legs open, mm-hmm. tie his arms down, and have sex in his booty. That's crazy. 
So niggas so, been getting fucked in the ass for the past 400 years. On, basically. Yeah. On purpose. And now they can't help it. They, ooh, I got a little feeling. Get it, Massa. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all look bad. Stop. Oh, Y'all don't have to do it no more, man. Some niggas can get fucked in the ass. Did you just say that you don't have to? You don't have to do Wait a minute. That. Okay, so let me talk choice. about something that I just read yesterday. I had to send it to someone. Has anyone heard of pegging? Huh? Why pegging. do I? What, like you throw, uh, you throw a tennis ball and peg somebody in the head. No. Uh, All right. Let me tell you what it is. Here we go. Oh, I thought it was ass Yeah, since y'all talking about asses, we're going to talk about asses. <laughs> so boy. this is when men like for... A woman to oh, strap to have a strap on or a dildo and penetrate them in their anus. No, nope, never heard of that. It's called pegging, and they and they say that the men are not gay or bisexual. Yeah, they but is. they just it's like the penetration so, because of the, the prostate. I heard of that shit. And then they like the feeling, and it's called pegging, and it's a lot of men that do it. And they will never admit it. <laughs> oh, don't sit up here and say that like one of us and did it. Is anybody touching me? Yeah, yeah. Anybody yeah. touching my ass? It's booty. It ain't none. They have never admit it. Yeah, them things. That, I mean, no. Yeah. And it's and it's like a part of like Shit. being a they submissive and a a, a dominant. Dom, was it dominatrix mm -hmm. and a submissive? See, people that don't mind, they gonna admit it because that's yeah, just what they do. Yeah, but it's a thing. It's a real thing. Hey, nah, I heard And it's a lot of yeah. black people that do it. Hey, stop that shit, man. Man, I'm real saying. Uh, not listen. Too, like, this, listen. Yeah, hey, look. Listen. Know, I don't be cha cha. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's, well, what if a man called, likes his salad tossed? And they do that. That's a part of it. No, no, no. There ain't no difference. No, no it's, it's not. Difference. Yes, yes, First of all, no, no, no. It's no, 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 a part of it. It's all a that, part that of pegging. Though, because ain't nobody. It's it's different between getting this bottle in your ass <laughs> and then somebody uh, just over there licking it. And shit. That's a big deal. That's, that's it's a it's a it's just like just like it's a difference between me eating your Fuji or putting my thing in there. That's a difference. That's a big that's a difference. difference. That's the same thing. That's a big. It's all big part of ass. pegging. They 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 that's lick it. That's not all a part they of the same thing. thing. That's not the same thing. They stuck in the booty hole. They lick it. Then they lube it up. The dildo, or how the you know this? You didn't peg somebody? Hell yeah! I okay. have not pegged. Oh yeah, they don't want to admit it, but they have to throw it in their face. Yeah, they 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 face. yeah. They were, I have not <laughs> inhaled anything. I did not have sex relations with that woman. You the peg nigga? Then you a peg I did not peggy? I have not. I ain't playing with you, peggy. And the equivalent to eating cooch is not a woman licking a man's butt. I'm sorry. I can say that's Licking me in his balls! I have a sex with my mouth! Licking me in his mouth! She almost caught the Holy Ghost on that one. Oh, only reason I know a step by step is because I actually read it yesterday. Ah, oh, step by step. You know every step. See, first, they what they do, it. they lubricate it, they lay a man down. They have and to they, make sure it's clean, then they lubricate it. Oh, and then they even told the people, like, oh, make sure he does an enema. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> in a in Ooh. a no. <laughs> Nope. They doing it. They doing it. Throat. And these are these are your these are your zaddies, your daddies. Hey, baby, those guys. Hey, now, they over there. Now, the niggas is out there though doing that. For shit. real. That's Thank that's you, D. Real. Come on, man. Right. But does it make a man gay? They said it does it, not yes, make him gay. That makes him gay. A dildo in the ass. A dildo will make you gay. <laughs> but a tongue in the ass don't make you gay. That's not in there. What? Surrounded. No, yes. they want no. Do you enjoy if you no, enjoy no, that no. out of your butt? Does that make you gay? No, I mean like what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> A what? If you what? Well, yeah. I said what? do you. Bees. No. Bees. No. So do bees. Anal bees. Do anal bees? Bees. No. <laughs> Nobody said no bees, man. What? 
Wait, 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 so I'm in a woman's group. It's like women, and all they talk about is dating. And, and somebody nice. said, exactly. they they had a topic said pegging. And I said, what is pegging? And then so I went down into the comments, Girl, and they start man, talking man. about all of this anal for men. That's what's wrong with y'all. I always in these little secret groups and stuff talking about weird a bunch of weird stuff that don't go on well, think about it. in the regular guy, households. The shit was going on, on wasn't it? Nah. Think about it. If you're married to somebody for a very on. long time, That's you guys become experimental. Uh, uh, good. <laughs> you know, <laughs> try new things that you ain't never tried before. Hey, babe. hey baby, it's been 15 years. <laughs> Let's I do wanna, something new for wanna, the, wanna, the anniversary. I want to bend over the couch and I want you to take I want you to take the pool stick, right? And get the pool stick. Well, not the pool stick. I, the cucumber. Get, cook that, get <laughs> Or a banana bar. <laughs> hey, d oh, 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 <laughs> A banana bar. Yo, you want that good old banana plastic bar? <laughs> Hell no. Hell. Well. <laughs> banana bar. Good old Vaseline. I don't know if y'all seen that banana bunker. It's it's a plastic holder for bananas. It's a hollow deal, though. <laughs> 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 it's, a hollow. It's, to keep your, <laughs> it's to keep your bananas safe. And yeah. from what? Yeah, yeah. From bruising, bruising. Yeah. You know Stay bananas bruise. Keep it safe from these women's groups. Because that's what talk about anal. What? What's his mind? You look at me. I look good. Move in. <laughs> Don't look at me. Shit. We <laughs> <laughs> Since we talking about anal, I ain't got paid. I ain't got paid. I don't want to talk about us. Y'all don't want to talk about niggas in there. Y'all, 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 y'all like that booty stuff? Oh, stuff booties in the Christmas turk. I'm not, I'm not into the booty stuff. I'm not into the booty stuff. Oh, get your ass lit. Nor am I. You get a lick. Look, man, look at me. That's cookies. a different story. Whoa, oh, 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 now oh, it's different. Now it's different. Uh, go ahead. I want you no, to there's, a, there's a bacteria that um, people are starting to get. Shut your mouth. Ain't nobody so, 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 so I need to get a Clorox wipe first. Wipe, wipe the booty with the Clorox wipe. Wipe the enema. You gotta do an enema. There's still shit in the ass, regardless of what yeah, you do. Yeah, yeah. And, and there's this bacteria that's causing them to um, get really sick. Where do you get this information from? Um, I'm also part of some site where I was reading. Some site. Oh, see? <laughs> some login. See? see? Your they got a password. That ain't Freak. my name on the site. <laughs> oh. On purpose. On the site. I mean, that's why Rick they're, that's why they're <laughs> private groups. <laughs> We can talk about it, but we can't yeah. give any names or anything like that. Nah, like, like, well, it's, no names. There's, <laughs> there's a bacteria that is going around from eating ass. Just saying, just putting that out there. I know. You know. What uh, the hey, we're we're talk, talk, don't don't mean, if, but if, no, you know. If there's something going on with your belly and you eat ass. But no, that makes sense. Oh, oh, is that, that, that makes E. coli? No, is that E. coli? E. coli. I'm gonna. It's like an MSRA. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let y'all know. But it, no, that makes like sense though. That makes sense though, because you can't really just go out there and just put your face in some ass, and you you never know what's backed up in there. You yep. you, you took a shit. You don't know if all that shit out there. Yeah, you know what I'm saying you go down there, you just in the booty hole licking. Say no you know to that. Thinking you want I mean, I don't even know who thought of this stuff. Nose. Like who thought of this? Like, so like, like an ass? Ass? I mean, no, yeah. Did somebody get bored and was like? Putting ass. That's what Nigel really? P said. Nah, I mean, because people be putting years. in their underarm. <laughs> hey, hey, putting one in their underarm. What's going on? They be using. Oh. Oh. Oh, I should use it for an example. Oh my God. <laughs> this feels so dirty right now. Sorry. But why is all of this like sticking in your ear? What you gonna do next? Like, you know what I'm saying? What's like, what's going on? Give me that ear, baby. Can you hear me? You heard me? You know, like this, you it's this? just extra. Can you hear this dick? Why? Like, are you that bored? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Do you get that bored? Why don't y'all go somewhere? <laughs> go somewhere. <laughs> go to a park. Go to the park. I'm trying to find. Go, go read some books. Go, yeah, go throw a free. No, that's the problem. <laughs> reading too much. I'm reading too much, huh? Goodness. Karma Sutra. Goodness gracious. Gosh. Mm. I mean, I'm gonna put a freaky, I mean, I'm gonna put a freaky deaky, but I'm gonna stick those same holes. Grabbing, grabbing them by the pussy. Wow, Trump! 
Right. See, that's what Trump. Yeah, I mean, that, that, that's what but we have no morals to. either. So look, look who we have as a leader. He's like grabbing him by the pussy. So now, since we have gotten on to Trump, um, how many have heard <laughs> right. of the USDA America's Harvest Box oh. or the one hundred percent American Food Package? Yeah, that was it. I just want to give a disclaimer. She's going to describe this, but it's basically a food box. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> Old school know what I'm talking about. Yeah, like, it's a, it's food, a box. food box that will 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 bring it back to replace food stamps. Wait, so instead of hold on. instead of okay, giving wait. you food well, we stamps, used to get food instead boxes, of giving you food get. stamps, they're going back to food boxes. You will get things like uh, shelf stable milk, mm-hmm. ready to eat cereal, pasta, peanut butter, used to get beans, that. canned fruit, yeah. vegetables, and meat. You just and go cheese, get right. Uh, you can I get the block cheese? Yeah. I did not read cheese, but I'm pretty sure it might be under there. I'm sure yeah. white people love to get so pre- cheese. So pretty much they, they love they, cheese. So pretty much they're just trying to regulate what's being given out. <laughs> white people food. love cheese. Love I'm gonna cheese. tell you this: white people love cheese. Love cheese. They you love wanna, cheese. You want to tame a, 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 a white person? Bring a cheese dish. Bring a cheese dish. Some sliced cheese. They love cheese. Nice. Crackers and cheese. Some meat and cheese, some dried meat and I some Sarah. cheese. They gonna answer. They gonna answer the door with an attitude once they see that cheese tray. I brought some cheese dip. Who who's at the door? Cheese. What are you doing? Oh, you brought. Oh, cheese. that's what it's called, rimming. Bro, that was so random. I know. Oh, okay, yeah. That's, that's yeah. still on your mind. I just I was trying to find the best. That's still on your mind. No more steak and shrimp. No mm-hmm. more steak and shrimp. Yeah, no more steak and shrimp. Mm. No you more steak and shrimp. Bologna and chips. It'll be all but, according to them farmed, grown, American. No, it's not. Yeah. Let, let, me tell you, <laughs> let me tell you, we used to get those same boxes when I was young. We used to get grilled cheese, uh, cheese in the box, a big rectangular size cheese, and then powdered milk. Powdered mm-hmm. milk. Ugh. You got your mm-hmm. cans of uh, peanut butter with mm-hmm. a whole bunch Candy, of oil at the top. Sauces. Mm-hmm. So yeah, all this type of stuff. But now they're they, going back to it. They're going back to it, but it's going to be poison. Oh, right. I agree. As usual. Wait, I still, it, no, oh, I feel oh, like so this is going to be like Oh, yes. Yeah. They revealed this or unveiled this today. Wait a minute. Speaking of poisoning, did you see people announcing that they got chipped? Did Wait, you see that? People what are we talking, talking about? about? They, they've been getting those chips. Oh, they, them. Yeah, and they're oh, proud of it. Chips. Yeah. yeah, and they're proud of it. Like, we're getting chipped. You know, because they've on been purpose. testing it on purpose. Yeah, on purpose. So, a part of all of this. You're not chipping me. So now they're controlling what people eat. Why the hell are people getting chipped on purpose? Oh, I'm so confused. Getting chipped on purpose. <clears throat> now they have the control so people can't even go to the grocery store and decide that, you know what, I want all veggies. Yeah. No. You right. need to get this processed food mm-hmm. out of this food box and you need to be chipped. We need to know where you are. We need to keep track of you. Get out from food stamps, y'all. Get your bread up. Get out from the food stamps. The government is up to no their usual. Chance, yeah, I mean, because... They're already trying to cut down the population. You see how they've been killing us. So they're trying to potato cut potato flakes. Yep. They, they're trying to cut cut down on the uh, population. <laughs> so now oh. they they going they taking away food stamps. Uh, they will reduce it. They're gonna, gonna take it away. So they taking they're yeah, gonna take away the food stamps to, to give people these food boxes, which is gonna eliminate people. Cause there's no nutrients in that. None of that. There, any everything that she does, nothing. So even the people that wanted to like breastfeed, they probably won't even be able to breastfeed if that's what they're getting. Yeah, they're gonna start drying. Food. They're gonna start drying up. Yeah, and you know they love to have children use formulas. Right. They love that baby <laughs> formula. They <laughs> love that stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Damn, that's my nigga feel bad. I show. I show was giving my baby that formula. Too. I hope people fully see this as an American. <laughs> but they, man, they had to. They made us do that though. My baby was a preemie. So they was like, nah, you gotta use the Neo Shore. Oh, like the really? preemie. You know, yeah. Was and they was no, but, us, there, but there's women that pump her. for yeah. preemies. They pump and they keep, they donate their, their breast well, she, milk. Well, see, BM, she, she, was, uh, she, she was breastfeeding for a little bit. And then she was like, fuck this. I'm this shit. <laughs> it is hard. I mean, it's she a like, thing because. She did it for like a month. She's like, man, fuck this shit. Because, you, because no in way. America, in the U.S., they don't push breastfeeding. Right. Mm-hmm. They kind of shun it, and they make everybody believe that. Oh no, don't do that. Or they kind of. Why are you breastfeeding? Yeah, why are you breastfeeding? Oh, well, that baby too big now. Why? Ooh, ooh. you know, it's baby, always because that baby is five years old <laughs> in the park on the this bus. This is in high school. <laughs> He's still over there licking on the bus. Technically.
basically, though, it'd be it's still very nutritious even at that age and very healthy for them. Yep. Even if they're eighteen, I will get the I will get the Borden. <laughs> oh no, because we want them to drink cow milk. Which and you and you know why people are lactose intolerant? Because you're not a baby cow. Yep. <laughs> Yep, yeah. I'm lactose intolerant. Yeah, because you're not supposed to be drinking hey, cow milk. Hey, can we define lactose? Like, what does what exactly does My that body mean? Because I know a lot of black people. I, I can break it down. <laughs> be saying this. Lactose intolerant, which is Latin for milk, and uh, it, it intolerant. You can't tolerate it no more. Your stomach. <laughs> <laughs> your, your, your stomach. Here we go. Your so, stomach is trying to break down those enzymes, and it's just. Not cooperating, so you get gas, and then you get more than gas. Once your yeah, stomach you can get puff diarrhea, up from, you can get yeah. all kind of stuff. Because I'm either hurling or girling. Because I don't be knowing if it's the milk, yeah, or, it's it's the, the, like or, or, or if it's the cinnamon toast crunch I just ate. It's it was a mix that you know that no, cinnamon that's, is a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's that feeling—the feeling that you get derailed. That's that's what that is. That's I ate the fruit. The fruit's got that fiber. You know that fiber fuck up your stomach too. Like, oh yeah, uh, <laughs> that fiber clean. Yeah, that raisin bread. Don't get caught eating <laughs> raisin bread in the morning, <laughs> and you got to go somewhere. No, I hear, I hear. Disclaimer: We are not advertising any of these brands. No. Yeah, I'm just talking about oh, raisin nah. bread, not. Uh, right. <laughs> well, my niece, my niece said, it, I guess it do her stomach something too. She says, uh, uh, I don't. Want the cereal because um, it has too many raisins in it. If you can take the raisins out, I can eat the cereal. I said, "Wow, I'm not taking the raisins out." She she don't want the raisins. She don't raisins. want the raisins in her cereal. She eat raisins all day, but she just don't want them in her cereal. But she's a smart baby. I I, I understand because if I eat raisin brands and I gotta go to a meeting, meeting cancel. <laughs> <laughs> oh snap! Hey, oh, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. Uh, call me. I'll put you on speakerphone. We can do a conversation. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. Well, all right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, all right. We done went to the bathroom. Let's shook it off. This was, this was pretty good tonight, y'all. Oh, yeah. What was it? What a shotgun, man. What a shotgun. Uh, after about 30, 40 oh, minutes. Fun. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> But uh, but thanks everyone for yeah, watching. Yeah, we appreciate it, and we'll be yeah, back yeah. next week. Same well, bat station, same bat. Station. Yeah, we we got it on tape, so I'm gonna edit it up, make it look real nice, put the intro on there, and then I'm gonna put it on Facebook, YouTube. So y'all check us out, subscribe to our YouTube page, and uh, we're gonna keep bringing it to y'all. We ain't gonna stop. Can't stop, Jesus, won't stop. Jesus, like Jesus. Oh, y'all like my Thank day? you guys. We, gonna, we probably let all loose gonna, entertainment. We go yeah, let loose 360 entertainment. Press. 360 press. 360 press. <laughs> uh, 361 press. Excuse me? In the house, everybody in the house. We just doing it like that. <laughs> <So> <laughs> everybody. everybody uh, and we everybody. Pew pew. Everybody doing it. Um oh, free promo. Uh, make sure to go on YouTube and check out the Guy Moments uh, cartoon. Shameless plug. Oh, no, no shameless plug. Go ahead and plug it, man. Uh, go on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> and check out the Guy Moments. Uh, check, out, uh, check out the Guy Moments cartoon. It's, uh, it's pretty funny. It's pretty funny. We got, uh, we got about yeah. a million some views on that thing. So y'all go. Y'all yeah, go I need to work with I've been watching a lot of series on YouTube. They got some good stuff on they there. They got some real good, good stuff, stuff on there. Good stuff on there. A lot of good black shows. Yeah. And I bet I bet you if I showed y'all my cartoon, y'all be like, I've seen this. Because it gets reposted on Facebook a lot. Yeah, I, uh, yeah. He, sent, he sent it to me. I, I need to work with that young man. Young boy, dub. Yeah. He says on YouTube. No, no, type in, just type in God moments. Thanks, y'all. So are we ending? Oh, I yeah, we we're going to wrap it up. Oh, we're going to count it down and wrap it up. So uh, no, this no. is Talk Up. And we do it like this. this? Yeah. When, when the camera's working, see y'all later.